Concordia University in Northeast Portland. The sun sets on one of the darkest days in the more than 100 year history of the school. It's a huge Concordia community that's just feeling a loss of a beautiful space. Professor Kim Knutson is among the thousands of staff and students who learned early Monday that the spring semester will be the last. We're one big family and it's just, it's really, really um, just shocking, just shocking and sad to lose that family. Knutson has spent more than a decade at Concordia. Her kids grew up on the campus. She and her colleagues are now scouring the web for new jobs. If we don't find a full-time position, teach as an adjunct, you know, just for food, have money for food. As Knutson ponders her future, so too do students and student athletes. Concordia promises to help with the transfer process, but there are still so many unknowns. Schools have closed down deadlines for applications. Getting financial aid is going to be a miserable task after this. For soccer especially, like rec recruiting starts right now, so... I'm, I have to get, either get on it right now or like wait a whole year to find another school to play at, I guess. If it's any consolation, a Portland attorney is taking legal action and trying to recoup this year's tuition for students, claiming the school knew since last year a closure was possible. That, according to the Portland Business Journal. Oh, it's just been my whole life. As for Kim Knutson, she plans to make the most of the little time she has left on campus. Probably just really appreciating every moment in the classroom with the students and um, supporting them. The final commencement ceremony is scheduled for April 25th with the School of Law commencement ceremony coming a week later. As for the athletic teams playing in the spring, they'll wrap up their current schedules and compete through postseason play. Reporting in Northeast Portland, I'm Mike Benner for KGW News.